Hey guys, it's Ryan with AIinsidertips.com. In this video, I'm going to show you the best free AI image generators. And yes, these are 100% free and some do require an account, but you do not need to pay anything to generate free AI images with these tools that I'm about to show you. Before diving in further, guys, if you haven't already to subscribe to my channel at AI Insider Tips, I would truly appreciate that as I spend hours putting these videos together for you doing all this research and just trying to provide as much value in the world of AI that I possibly can. So I would truly appreciate you guys subscribing. Now, the first tool I wanna to show you is the Microsoft Bing Image Creator. You do need a free Microsoft account to use it. So you do have to sign up for an account, but it is free. And guys, what's really cool about this is it is powered by Dolly technology. Now, I'm not sure if it's still Dolly 3, it could be powered by Dolly 2. Um, it used to say Dolly 3 up here, but ever since Dolly 3 was kind of integrated into ChatGBT+, I'm not sure if it's Dolly 3 to be 100% transparent, but it is Dolly technology. So in this example, I'm going to be using the same text to image prompt and I'm going to prompt a bunch of these different free AI image generators. And then I'm going to compare what I think is the best one for free and that you should try using. So the prompt I'm using is the following, a dog playing in the snow with Christmas trees in the background. And I've already went ahead and prompted these tools so we don't have to sit here and wait for the images to be generated. So let's take a look at this guys. In the Bing image creator, these are the four images that it created for me based off this simple simple text prompt. So not bad. Some of these look extremely realistic. That's a cool picture. Um, I like that picture. It has presents and Christmas trees with ornaments and everything on it. That's a cool picture as well. I like the background. Um, that's a close up picture. So whatever your preference or use case is for these images, again, you can ask it whatever you want in the text. I'm just doing something simple here to show you guys some free options. Now, what's also cool about the Bing image creators, if I wanna click this one is that's my favorite image. You can share it, you can save it. You can also download it and then customize it in Photoshop. You can customize it in Canva and then you can use it however you want. So I do like that option, how you are able to even download these and then share them or customize them to whatever you prefer. So that's the first tool guys is the Microsoft Bing image image generator. So if you don't have access to that for whatever reason, you can just come to Bing chat. So you just go to bing.com and I'll do this in real time. If you go to bing.com, click chat up here, then what you can do is again, you just need a free Microsoft account to use this. Make sure you're hovered over the creative as I believe that will give you the best outputs and then simply ask whatever prompt you want. So I'm gonna say a dog playing in the snow with Christmas trees in the background and this should generate AI images within Bing chat using that Dolly technology. It says, I'll try to create that. So I'll skip ahead and then I'll come back after it's created. All right, so here are the images that Bing chat created. So. Not bad. Again, if I click this, that's something I want to call out. It does redirect you to the Microsoft Bing image creator. So this is powered with the same tools, same technology. It's just easier to access through Bing chat. You can also do this for Microsoft Copilot. This is again, the same thing as Bing chat, the same thing as the Microsoft Bing image creator, just showing you as many options as possible. So guys, the next one I wanna show you is actually Google search results. So if I come to the Google search results and I say, uh, create me an image of a dog playing in the snow with Christmas trees in the background, you'll see it says generating. So you can actually generate AI images straight from Google search results. Some people do not know that this exists. Now the quality of these images are not as great as the Bing image creator, just looking at these right away. But again, I can cater this text to whatever I want and it doesn't hurt to just use the same prompt for many AI image generator tools and then just compare contrast afterwards. So now if you don't have this, all you need to do is be signed into your Google account. So you need to make sure you're signed in to your Google account click this option here that says search labs. And then once you click search labs, you need to check this option here, SGE generative AI and search. You have to turn this on in order for that to work. I would also turn this one on too, just in case. So then once you have those on, simply come back to Google search and type in whatever you want. So just say, you know, create me an image of a dog. I'll just do another example here really quickly to show you what I mean. And then it should say generating here. So give it a few seconds. Again, there are the AI generated images right there. And if I click it, I can edit it inside Google. I can export it, like it, dislike it, tell the algorithm what I'm looking for. 
Um, here's some options from Google Images. But guys, that's another option is using Google search results to generate AI images. So the third option, this one recently came out and I have a dedicated video on this that I'll leave a link to below, um, is called Imagine with Meta AI. Now Meta AI owns Facebook, Instagram, WhatsApp. They also own a large language model called Llama 2. And they recently just came out with their own AI text to image generator. So in this example, again, I gave it the same prompt, a dog playing in the snow with Christmas trees in the background. And I have to say, I'm truly impressed with this in terms of realism. The realism, you know, produced by Imagine with Meta AI, in my opinion, is head and shoulders above these other free AI image generators. So I'm looking right here. That looks extremely realistic. That looks extremely realistic. This one also looks extremely realistic. And if you click this button with the three dots, again, you can download this straight from Imagine with Meta AI. You can upload it into Canva. You can upload it into Photoshop and make any customizations that you want just from these AI generated images in this Imagine with Meta AI. So again, a really cool free option that you guys can just simply create as many images as you want from simple text prompts. The next tool I want to show you is called Leonardo AI. So Leonardo AI has been around for several months and has been a pretty good alternative to mid journey. Um, it is a freemium model. So you have to sign in to an account to create these free images. And you also have credits. You'll see here I have 142 credits. Um, I'm not sure exactly how many credits count for one image, um, but this will run out quickly if you generate a lot of images at once. So in this example, I did the same prompt, a dog playing in the snow with Christmas trees in the background. And again, Leonardo AI, I mean, the images are fairly similar, um, but some of these look really good. So if I click this again, I can download it. Um, I can copy to my clipboard. I can remove the background too. If I want to do that, it will cost me two tokens to do that. Um, but you can remove the background. So no background, just a really cool feature inside Leonardo AI. Again, download, upload to Canva, Photoshop, do whatever you want with this AI generated image. So that's another free AI image generator, Leonardo.ai. Guys, the last one I want to show you is called ideogram.ai. So if I go to ideogram.ai, click the enter button on my keyboard. Here is ideogram.ai. So what I like about this one is you can go through and look at what the community is creating for this free AI image generator. You can click by recent. So a lot of Christmas images, which is kind of cool to see. You can click trending and scroll down through these different trending images. Um, and so let's say, for example, I want to click on this one. Um, this actually gives the exact prompt of what someone's using to generate this image. So really cool, in my opinion, that it even provides the prompt. Uh, same with this one, provides the prompt here. Um, so this is another great option. If I come up to the top and want to create my own AI image, I'm going to do a dog playing in the snow with Christmas trees in the background. I'm going to click generate. And then it is generating my AI images right here. Now, one thing I also want to mention is you do need an account to use Ideogram. You'll see here I'm signed in to my profile. I've used this in the past for a couple examples, but here's the example that I just did, a dog playing in the snow with Christmas trees in the background. So again, this looks fairly realistic. That one looks very good in my opinion. And also this first one looks good too. I could download these, I could favorite these, I can share these to the community on ideogram.ai. So just another great tool, ideogram.ai. So guys, if you are looking for premium AI image generators, of course I have to mention Midjourney. Midjourney was the pioneer in AI image generation. Um, and they, the quality is still there in my opinion. Now there are other tools creeping up to Midjourney in terms of quality, uh, but Midjourney is still a very sophisticated AI image generator. Dolly 3, of course. Now this is integrated inside ChatGBT+. So you do need to be a member to access Dolly 3, which costs $20 per month. I believe Midjourney costs $10 per month. It could change, but I believe that's still the price. The last one too is Adobe Firefly. So I am signed in and Adobe Firefly does offer some limited credits that you can use. Um, so I'm actually going to do this in real time, guys. I'm just going to go to Adobe Firefly. And this is a very good AI text to image generator. This is up there with Mid Journey and Dolly 3, in my opinion, in terms of the quality. So you'll see right here if I click this. 
Um, it gives me a bunch of different options. Um, four images based on the text prompt. Guys, Adobe Firefly is better for more sophisticated prompts. Same with Mid Journey and Dolly 3. Those tools are better as you get more sophisticated with image dimensions, aspect ratios, text, font, color, um, and all the nitty gritty that goes into generating images from a graphic design standpoint. So again, you do need to be and you do need to pay for Adobe Firefly. I believe it's about $5 a month just buying it straight out. Um, or it also comes with uh, a lot of these Adobe plans. So you'll see the Adobe Express plan starts at 10 bucks a month. So Adobe Firefly is five bucks a month. And the only reason I have Firefly is I have Adobe Photoshop. So it came with whatever package that I bought when I purchased Photoshop. Um, but that's it, guys. Again, this is Ryan with AI Insider Tips. Just wanted to show you my favorite free AI image generators that don't cost any money and you can just start creating AI generated images right away. So again, guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, I would truly appreciate that at AI Insider Tips. Be sure to like this video, leave me a comment below on any free AI image generators that I didn't mention in this video. I'm always looking to learn new tools and explore new things with AI guys. Um, so be sure to comment below if you have tools that you use that I missed. And I hope you all have a great day.